in Pacific City, Oregon. They have a great website, heartscamp.com. Uh, as you can see here on this map, it is within walking distance of all the great places that you want to go see during at, in Pacific City. Uh, you've got um, Pelican Brew Pub within walking distance, Marketplace where you can get ice cream and, and groceries, Doryland Pizza, there's a bakery coffee shop, and of course Cape Kiwanda itself. As you come in, you're going to see um, this little kite shop where you can pick up a fresh kite. The office, which was closed during December 2020, when we were there, they just sent us a code. And there's even a laundry facility there where you can wash your clothes. As you come in, this board greets you with a map, and then um, you just punch in your code here and the arm lifts up so it's nice and secure. There's a little green building here where it looks like there's a facilities manager and then the bathrooms are those two white doors right there. And I think the men's is around the corner. Nice little um, picnic area. Let's talk about bathrooms real quick. Very clean, um, two or three toilets, double sinks, and a very clean shower. This is a really great area with a group um, fire pit, a really fun surf wall, uh, surfboard wall, where you can take cute photos, um, uh, picnic tables. This area is normally covered with rabbits, rabbits everywhere. So if you have a dog, you might want to leash them up. Um, and then this area to the right back here is a really cool rental area. All of those airstreams are rentals. And I'm gonna show you this more in detail in a moment, but it's really a nice facility. I, if I didn't have an RV, I'd rent it for sure. This is These are pull-through sites. The garbage is back here to the left of that freshly built um, wood structure there next to the uh, store itself, storage. We're gonna take a tour of these right now. I think in the summertime, spring and summer, when this is all bloomed out, it's gonna be beautiful, but these were dressed so cute for Christmas. They had pretty wreaths, lots of Christmas lights, well done, wasn't tacky at all. Right here, they come with a barbecue and a garbage can and a cute little deck. Um, of course, a really neat Airstream. Picnic table and nice chairs and even a little box with wood cut up for you and even this really clever little fire starter. I thought that was neat. And as you can see, lots of really pretty um, plants in here. I think in the spring and summer, this would be absolutely stunning. Lots of privacy from the neighbor. Mm. And this is my favorite part. This outdoor shower. Oh, I wanted to use this so badly. Super cute. Great place to wash off the sand. Now, as you come into the park, these are pull-through sites. There are 30 and 50 amp at this park. Lots of details on their website. Each site has um, a place where you can dump your septic. It has a picnic table, um, water. They're a little skinny. Um, and I'll show you that as we get closer to my RV. Nice and flat though. Cable, water and power. These are the back end sites that are along the back fence. And this would be a great place to go group. You can see all of our stuff kind of sprawled out. We weren't being very clean. <laughs> and um, I think if we had if it had been a packed summer time, we could have, as you can see here, we could have pushed our RV closer to the wall or line here and had more space. And there's a little horseshoe pit here. Lots of areas to have fun and play. Very nicely done park, very cute. And as you can see, this is mid-December of of 2020 so weather was great wonderful place to go winter camping nice and dry and of course this is Cape Kiwanda the Chief Kiwanda Rock beautiful absolutely stunningly beautiful the day we were here there was uh, a wedding that had taken place up on that mountain and then they had come down and were taking photos down here so it was kind of fun really beautiful I bet the lighting was stunning Very peaceful area. Cool. 
And this is Cape Kwanda. This is a great place if you want to have a good challenge. You walk up this hill and run down. It's very fun. Lots of areas to go and drive to and, and have a picnic or just go play on the beaches. Obviously a beautiful area. I would highly recommend Hearts Camp. It was um, a great little spot to stop. <music>